Hey Roma, how are you feeling today? I'm doing better, thanks. And thank you for coming to see me. Of course, I'm always here for you. How is your health? It's been tough, but I'm trying to stay positive. Thanks for asking. No problem. Listen Roma, did Alex come to see you? No, he didn't. But we talked on the phone. What did he say? He said he is busy at home, but he promised to visit soon. I miss him so much. That's good to hear. I'm sure he will come when he can. Yeah, I hope so. It would mean a lot to me to see him. He likes you, Roma. I'm sure he will find time to visit. I believe you, Monica. Thanks for always being there for me. Roma. I really need to go home. My mom is alone, and I promised I wouldn't stay out too long. Can you stay with me for a little bit? I'm feeling bored at the hospital. I'm sorry, honey, you know my mom. Oh, all right, Monica. I understand. It's just so boring here without you. I know, but I promise I will come back tomorrow, okay? We can spend more time together then. Okay, I will try to be patient. Thanks for coming today. Hey Rowan, have you heard anything about Roma? How is she? Are you serious, Amir? You are the one who caused all of this. And now you are asking about her? Look, I can't go to the hospital, okay? Did you tell anyone? No, I haven't told anyone yet. But that doesn't mean you are not in trouble. I'm just saying. If you need money or anything, I can help you out. But keep it quiet. Oh, thanks for offering, but I don't need your money. However, Amir, you have to deal with what you did to Roma. Watch your words, Rowan. You don't want to mess with me. Don't even think about threatening me, Amir. Fine, do whatever you want. But remember, there will be consequences. I'm not afraid of your threats. I will do what's right. Did you make it all for yourself? Yes, I cooked all these for you. This is delicious. I'm glad you like it, Alex. It's my pleasure to cook for you. I wanted to make something special for you. You are too kind, Monica. I don't know what I did to deserve all this. You don't have to do anything. I just want to take care of you. I'm just happy to see you enjoying the meal. I want to make you happy. And you do, you really do. I love you, Alex. Doctor, I wanted to ask about Roma's condition. When do you think she will be discharged? We are watching Roma carefully to see how she is doing. The treatment seems to be working, and we are hopeful that she will get better soon. Thank you, doctor. I just want her to be back home with us soon. I completely understand, don't worry, she will be all right soon. I appreciate all the care you and your team. It's our duty. Take care. Did you hear what the doctor said, sweetheart? You are going to be all right soon. Yeah, mom. I can't wait to go home. Alex, I just can't wait. Will you marry me? Monica, 
we have only just started dating. Let's go slowly and see how things go. But, I love you so much. I don't want to wait. I understand, but marriage is a big decision. We need to be sure. Don't you love me? Of course I do, Monica. But we need to be patient. If you love me, why don't you want to marry? It's not that, I just haven't talked to my parents about us yet. Then talk to them. Let them know how much we love each other. Okay, I will talk to them. Thank you, Alex. I can't wait. I love you.